I just want to make a point of how beautiful people are. And I'm even talking about the people who have dumped on you, shit on you, they have thrown the worst at you. Is there a way for you to love and accept them so that you can expand beyond their bullshit? But for me, it's taking me years to realize that I really do love everyone. I'm so grateful for everyone, but I couldn't do this until I could first love myself. And it literally hit me this morning as I'm writing in my journal, I had to learn how to love myself first in order to love everybody. But I couldn't love myself first until I learned how much God already loves me. If God loves me, if he sees me without fault, why do I, why can't I? <laughs> why can't I do that myself? So finally coming to this right at the end of the year, about to have this huge launch and realizing that I really do, I love myself. I love who I am. I love who I've become. I even love the shy, timid, insecure version of myself because if I wasn't that woman, I wouldn't have become this woman that I am today. And it has allowed me to really just be so grateful and love everybody around me and I'm coming into this I have this super flow going on where I've constantly have new women new clients new prospects new opportunities daily coming into my life and it really is I think super flow is the best way to describe it and this was a missing piece it's just being able to love everyone and then it finally, and I've learned this, but I never felt it connected to everybody. But this morning, as I was journaling, I felt connected to everyone. Because I realized, you know, God is in me, which means that I'm a part of God. God is in everyone. So, based on that equation, we are all connected because God is in each and every one of us. And I really could feel myself just flying and soaring through the world, being connected with everyone. And it was a very cool feeling. But I couldn't love everyone until I could love myself. And I couldn't love myself until I realized how much God already loved me. So I hope this brings you some peace and gratitude and love as you can sit and learn and realize how much God already loves you. He loves you so much. Can you love yourself so that you can love the world? And when that happens, you open up so many beautiful doors. And that's what I wish for you, especially for 2022, is to open up so many amazing, beautiful doors. I send you loving kindness and peace and prosperity. Bye-bye, money queens!